Hey everybody, and welcome back to Receiver. So, the good news, if this ever loads, is that I have gotten a new keyboard. Uh, and that's why I've chosen to play Receiver. And that's because uh, Receiver is actually one of the few games I play that... Uh... Oh, wow, that's a lot of bullets. It's one of the few games that I play that uh, is got a lot of keyboard in it. Now, that being said, Binding of Isaac is the other one. However, oh, that's right. I actually have to hold things to pick them up. It's been a while since I played this game. You are listening to the first tape of the Perpetual set. This set of tapes represents the most critical receivings, so that I'm gonna let this run since it's been a while. They will need after the mine kill. This set, when listened to sufficiently and in its entirety, has been speculated to be the minimum teachings needed to achieve an awake state. Besides this tape, the tapes included in this set are Firearm Operation, Initiation Tape A, Mind Tech, Reality B, Mind Tech Clear Tape, Mind Kill Contingency, Kill Drones, Repeat Listenings. Sorry about that. The Clear Tape, Awake. It's been a while since I've played this game, so I just wanted to move my monitor up to be a little bit more immersed, uh, which I think helps, personally. But that said, uh, yeah, I'm sure you've already noticed, you cannot hear the keyboard very well. There's no clickety-clickety-clack uh, that we're also used to. And I think that's going to be beneficial. How is there nothing in this room that is going to hurt me? Uh, I've definitely not played this in a while, as I think I've already started to mention. Uh, which to me just means that I'm going to get killed a lot and really fast. But this is going to be a really short episode. Uh, Binding of Isaac, well, not a really short episode, this is just going to be a quick episode. These are always usually pretty quick. I only play one or two uh, iterations. Uh, that said, The Binding of Isaac is my other really keyboard heavy game that I play. Uh, but the problem there, and why I can't show off my new keyboard there, is because uh, I have such a huge backlog. Um, I think I just released episode, like, 25, 26? I, I don't even remember. Um, sweet flashlight. I don't really want it right now, but... Uh, but yeah, I just released, like, 20, and I recorded, like, 55 or 56 last night. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a good number of episodes until uh, that's all taken care of. And by that, I mean uh, another flashlight? I guess like we're doing another flashlight run. Oh uh, but yeah, it'll be a little while until those are all good and clean of sound, of obnoxious sound. Can't believe I haven't seen anything that's like going to try and kill me yet. Man, it's so quiet. It's so quiet when I play. And I don't have anything to particularly say at the moment. At least before the uh, illusion of sound from the keyboard. Oh crap. Gotcha. It's one. a gun all the way over there. And a drone. Saw the drone. Oh, holy crap. It's right there. Alright. Oh man, I'm so... That's right. I'm a little rusty at this game. I overshot that. I'm fully aware of that. Uh, 
Uh, I'd rather be safe than sorry with those drones. I know there's a gun over there. I'm more concerned about other drones. I think this room is clear. And past. Nice. We can pick up tape number two. Your minds have been spied on. The rules of our world don't apply to yours, and so the threat has made a careful study of listening to your thoughts. The kill drones are the result of this research. When confronting a kill drone, be mindful of their weak points. The main systems that can be damaged are the camera, weapon, motor, and batteries. Hate that. On a kill drone turret, the batteries and motor are in the body of the weapon. The motor is directly under the turret and the batteries behind that near the rear of the body enclosure. Targeting specific weak points will make sure every bullet counts. Alright, so as you hopefully noticed, uh oh, I've fallen to the wrong side and now must move very quickly, or move very slowly. Yeah, I don't have any choice but to go all the way back because I'm stuck in this really weird uh, situation. I don't think running is going to help all that much. Uh, there's drones or something above us. I just saw a flash of blue light. Yeah, but that's me mashing what you just heard right there. I'm actually just falling off because I don't want to get stuck there again. Oh, crap. Where is that drone? Okay, it's right there. I'm trying to get this this tiniest sliver of a shot. It's moved, unfortunately. Looks like it went up. That was totally not true. There's probably another drone up there, is probably what it is. So be very cautious. Yep. Oh, that one's not actually. Okay, I've got five shots. And remember, just the tiniest window. Trying to give myself as much room as I possibly can. This thing is going to eventually come at me. I have to hope that it does it slowly and unintelligently. Got it. Nice. Like, I know where I'm supposed to aim on these, but sometimes they just don't react. Because you're supposed to aim at the battery, which is right there. Either that or it's back there, and maybe I'm wrong. Wait, we got another drone, we got another drone. Nice! That's gotta be, like, one of the most successful... I want you to come out. Thank you. We're still doing pretty darn good on ammo, if I do say so myself. Oof, that loading barrier hurt, especially because there's that turret all the way over there. This place looks to be clear. And I say looks because that's a very... Uh, it's a very risky thing to say. Ooh, crap. I really don't feel like inciting the Rage of Drones moment. I already had enough fun with this room. Oh, speaking of... I 
I actually got it that time. Sweet, another tape. If you are listening to this tape, it means you have survived the minefield. Previous attempts to listen to this tape would have found it blank, but now it contains immediate instructions of your difficult path forward. This is the time that we have prepared for. Take a moment now to find your firearm. Some of you will be familiar with firearms from our training camp, but more recent receivers will have focused on mine tech in order to survive the mine kill event. In either case, please take a moment to confirm that the firearm you have been issued is in working order and contains one full magazine. You have also been issued one tape deck with headphones and two AA batteries. Once you have checked your equipment, leave the safe cell. Keep moving and be careful. The threat will have dreamed and kill drones near your location. I don't know if this is a good idea. But it worked, so... I call retroactively that it was a good idea. I was letting the tape play out there, as well as concentrating. Combination of things. You gotta be careful jumping off of stuff. You can kill yourself by falling. And it's a really crappy way to go, too. Especially considering that... Of all the things that can kill you... That drone didn't quite see me, luckily. Good. Okay, I've definitely gotten the where to aim down on those guys. I'm pretty confident, at least. Uh, unfortunately, with the revolver, uh, I just I'm just paranoid. I'm just paranoid about how many shots I have left because I only have six, which means I reload basically every chance I get. I forgot I'm still crouched. I think that's a tape. I want to be sure there's nothing else here that's dangerous. Including through that door. Don't see a tape there, I just see bullets. Okay, looks like the immediate area is in fact safe. So I can pick up three bullets. We're doing well. I've got three tapes though. I've definitely had runs where I've gone significantly faster. Uh, I'm concerned about this room. For a couple reasons. Uh, the big one is if there are drones and they fly up from below, I'm gonna have very little time to notice. I did not intend to do that, to jump off that, but it didn't end up killing me, so I'm okay. Alright. There's nothing in this room explicitly. Really? Alright. Remember, it's very important to clear corners as best you can. I just remained constantly moving. Sweet bullets. I just remained constantly moving just in case there was a turret, because they don't track perfectly. Now, I'm not hearing any of the uh, ominous music, so I'm going to go ahead and assume that there aren't actually any tapes in here, because otherwise we would know. But this has been very uh, profitable in terms of bullets, so I'm not going to complain. Alright, so there's nothing I can do from here. Anywhere that I go will kill me, basically. So I'm going to go down. That might be unwise, but I'm going to give it a shot. I'm trying to check for drones or turrets as I go. Last thing I want to do is get sniped. This appears to be clear. That's not, though. Oh, there's something over there. Bullets and another flashlight. Wait, I want to put that there. Now I have three flashlights. Okay, I don't like that room. 
Uh, I don't like that room because there's two guns in either corner, and shooting at one will likely get us shot by the other. I th think this might be where we started. I know we've gone in circles a little bit. Um, I'm going to go ahead and suggest that this is, in fact, where we started. Obviously, there's no shell casings around, because we would have cleared it. This looks familiar, and then we, we moved back through there. So, I'm gonna go this way. That was close. That was really close. That thing could have taken a shot, and we probably would have been done. Alright, I'm hearing the music. Oh crap, that's a drone. Okay, that took it out too. Uh, totally okay with that. Wait for that to go, and then I've got as long as possible to aim at that. Come on. Oh, you were a good bullet. That's okay. Better safe than sorry. Those load barriers are probably the most dangerous thing in this freaking game sometimes. I'm expecting another gun or drone. I'm gonna go ahead and guess so that we haven't collected enough tapes for them to be spawning them like mad. This room now appears to be clear. I at least have guns on the bottom floor and drones from the sky. I'm just going to continue on this way, because this hallway looks pretty clear. We've got some music. It's always good. I'm going to presume that there's guns in this house. Appear to be none in the kitchen. Or the main room here. Doesn't mean the bathroom is safe. Doesn't mean the upstairs is safe. That's where I'm presuming... This is where the danger is going to be. So I'm going to clear this corner as fast as I can. Alright. If I'd seen a gun, I would have ducked back the other way. Alright, this is another dangerous part. Going upstairs is always dangerous. You have to be ready to move back down immediately. Luckily, all this is clear. We do get some bullets. Which means I very much believe that there is something over here in this room. Just a lot of bullets. Okay, but that means we're probably on the path to a tape. Because the tapes are usually out in the open, they're pretty obvious. Uh, I have not tried jumping off that, I don't want to find out. We can't open anything, so there's no reason to check that. Okay, so the key to these load barriers is to just inch forward. And look, I was inching and I went like a full foot in. Luckily, no gun there. Two guns there. for that second beep, and good. And boom. Alright. Drone, drone. I'm ready to strafe the hell to the right. I'm not turning that corner ever again. Headshot. Um, I saw a spotlight go up this wall. Yep, okay, there's another one. I'm not turning that corner again. I'm going to wait for it. 
Because if I turn that corner and it just bolts at me, I cannot escape it. It might be above, though. I'm actually going to go around. I'm going to go around. Give these two bullets. Oh, crap. I thought I saw blue, but... Ooh. Crap. Dang it. I got three shots into it, but none of them were lethal. And down we go. But that was 20 minutes. Um, and I have a revolver again. I really have no love for this revolver. I really just, I just don't. It's hard to tell how much you've got left. They don't reload easy or quickly. And your ability to fire is severely limited. And I don't think you gain anything either, to be honest. I don't think you gain anything from having the revolver over one of the other guns. It's not like it's more powerful or anything. Um, well, we found a tape. I guess I guess we'll go through with this run. Your crude world is not the true reality. We're gonna go a little faster though, a little reckless. Shadow cast by your transcendent mind. We call this higher plane reality A. There's a gun on the other side of that. That's really if sucky. You are receiving this message in a fictional context, you are at an even deeper level, one that we cannot reach. Because your body oh, is a Jesus. shadow of your mind, when your mind dies, your body will vanish. In the really? normal order of your world, that this merely a game is trolling me. which your mind is set free. But for victims of the coming mind kill, there is only a flipping. I want to know if it can see me here. The answer is yes. Okay, we got that one. Alright, done crouching. The one upstairs sucks, but I'll figure out a way to deal with it. I'm just going to clear this first. If I can get a better angle on it, that'll be better for me anyway. I need a better angle on it. I couldn't get through the rails at it. Don't want this flashlight. This is a significantly better angle, mind you. Got it. Fill the revolver up again. This will be the last run, or the last part of it. Two runs of receiver in one episode actually isn't bad, because it means I did well. Or at least well enough that uh, one lasted pretty long. That's usually more than you can say about stuff. Man, I'm hearing the music and there's no tape. This bed looks comfy. Can I just get in the bed? There, can I just go to sleep and wake up in reality? That'd be nice. Silly dystopias. I don't even. Well, I don't even think it's qualified as a dystopia. To be honest. Hello, drone. That one is in another area. I don't think it can actually detect us. Nope, it's not, actually. Okay. Oh! Hey, buddy! I shot your taser! <laughs> You're funny. You're cute. You're freaking the fuck out. Fido. Seriously. I'm just trying to get a shot. There we go. It was funny that it couldn't hurt me. Uh, it, it definitely uh, showcases the fact that this, uh, this game is doing quite a lot. Oopsie, didn't even put any bolts back in. Well, the game's doing quite a lot um, in terms of, you know, the fact that you can shoot various parts of the drone and it figures it out. I mean, it doesn't mean the game is flawless, but definitely some uh, some benefits here. I'm just going to take care of it, because I might as well. I hit ya. Gotcha. I'm going to have to go across that bridge at some point anyway. 
Especially because I can't go, uh, I can't just cross on that highest level. I'm going to have to go down since there's no connection. Oh gosh, something's going on. Oh, you, 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 you. I did it again? Really? You're st I wish I had, a, like, a thing to smack you with, because this is just annoying. Seriously, what are you thinking right now, you silly thing? I am running low on bolts. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to charge this way and run back. Dang. Run this way. This is technically good practice for when they're coming at me, but it's a gigantic waste of bullets. I just don't want one following me all the time. I think I shot it in the taser again. I think I am now out of bullets. Like, I think I've used the entire clip. Yep. Well, clip's not really the right term, but... Uh, so yeah, this is my last revolver, like, my last... Ch I don't know what you actually call it in a revolver. I need to lose it. I like need to lose it. Alright. <laughs> that was so much easier and saved so many more bullets. Oh, that was really stupid. Alright, well. You're kidding me. Okay. <laughs> I thought I had hit the taser for the third time, because uh, it wasn't actually tasing. Uh, of course, as much as I love this gun, as I said, that was the last one. Keep the episodes relatively short, so they're a little bit more watchable. I mean, while it might be fun for me to play an hour of receiver, uh, it's definitely not as fun to watch. Although, I really should get back into this game. Either way... I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I hope you learned something. I hope you appreciate my new keyboard uh, because, um, well, I mean, boy, it wasn't cheap. I got a nice one. But more importantly, I did it because I, I got a lot of comments about how annoying it was. And honestly, when I watched my own stuff, it got a little bit annoying, even though I like the clackety clack. Uh, so, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. And, uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time.